Allergy versus low immunity versus autoimmunity. My child keeps wheezing. My child has asthma. My child has some form of allergy. These are certain issues when parents report and they ask one common question and that is does my child have low immunity? Should I give some form of immune booster so that I can handle these kind of issues like asthma, wheezing or allergies? So friends, to understand and to answer this question, I have to introduce you to a very new concept. The concept that differentiates low immunity from allergy and autoimmunity. Let me take you through this brief video and explain how different are these three things. What is autoimmunity? Who protects us against the bad bugs, the virus, the bacteria? Do you know? It's the white cells in our body, our army. They attack these bad bugs and they kill them. My white cells do not attack my own cells. They don't attack my kidneys, my lungs, or for that matter, my heart. Ever wondered why? My white cells know it's my tissues. It's my organs. And that's why they don't attack them. But what if they fail to identify what is mine? They start attacking my kidneys, my lungs. And that's what we call autoimmunity. Heard of autoimmune diseases? Rheumatoid arthritis, lupus, and many of such conditions where white cells of our body attack our own tissues. That's autoimmunity. What is allergy? Now what's allergy? White cells attack what is bad, the bad bugs, right? But what if they attack something that's not harmful? You eat food, right? It's not harmful. And what if the body overreacts to the food substance and produces lots of chemicals and these chemicals cause itching, the skin allergy. Now these chemicals cause some problems in the lungs and that's where you start wheezing and you develop asthma. So it is a situation wherein white cells are overreacting to substances which are not harmful and that's what we call allergy. It's kind of a hypersensitive state. Now you know Allergy is not a state where your immunity is low, it's just disturbed. And that's why when you have allergies, you don't need immune boosters. So let's thank the immune system for attacking the bad bugs, for not attacking our own tissues, and for simply not overreacting against harmless substances.